hi everyone welcome back to my channel i want to wish you a happy new year and at the same time share with you how i prepare teriyaki chicken sandwich i will start on how to prepare the bread i just prefer to do the bread by myself because i think it's more healthy because i know exactly what is inside so uh, i have the ingredients here what you need you need two uh, teaspoons of uh, salt and then you need 45 grams of yeast you need a um, white egg, you need a whole egg, you need 60 grams of butter, 100 milliliters water, three, um, sorry, 250 milliliters of milk, and then two tablespoons of honey, and 500 grams of flour. And I will use my kitchen machine to, to prepare the, the dough of the bread. So I will start with the meal. And then I add the milk. Actually, you just need to add all the ingredients together. And what I'll do, I'll put the yeast in the water, dilute it completely. And then I add the honey. Actually, the water is a little bit warm so that you can melt easily there's still a lot inside Wait. then just stir them well to get a good mixture as you can see it turns the color Make sure you take the liquid honey when you are preparing this, it's better. Put it all together. Then just add the butter. Normally you can let your butter melt for a while, but um, I started late. Add the salt, the white egg. Then the whole egg and let the kitchen machine work for you. But actually, you can also do it with your hands, like here. No, you don't have to necessarily use a kitchen machine, but it's easy and comfortable. So, maybe around 10 minutes, then it work by itself. So, as I wait for the for the dough of the bread to get ready because you have to let it settle for one hour i will prepare the teriyaki sauce and i got the ingredients here what you need you need soya sauce four tables uh, four tablespoons of soya sauce you need four tablespoons of worcester sauce i will show you what that is because i can't pronounce it really well it's an american sauce huh? and then you need six tablespoons of uh, uh, apple vinegar. You need four tablespoons of honey. And then you need two tablespoons of mustard. And you need four tablespoons of tomato. Tomato, I don't know how you call it in English. In German, it's terrible. It always dominates. And then you got some ginger <laughs> and you got some garlic and so let's get started what you do you just put all of them together i got my pan ready step by step Next one, what you do, you just 
great there on the inside. The ginger as well. I don't know who else because because um, experience the same problem like me when you speak so much German while well, you're speaking German 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 and then you just want to reach out to your English people and you start speaking English and then you notice how your English is getting worse time by time so let me put more fire just for a moment Just tear all this together. Huh? You see, we'll get better with time. Mm -hmm. Steer, just continue to steer. Get all the ingredients together. Make sure you cook with low heat, eh? otherwise, it will start misbehaving and um, sticking to the pan. In the meantime, as this is happening, I'm going to, to put low heat really like so, as that is happening, I will prepare the chicken. I have chicken filet and I will just cut it into small pieces. Even smaller. And now, as you can see, the chicken has been cut into small pieces. And then you put uh, cornstarch. Um, these were two, two, two tablespoons of um, cornstarch. You put it in the meat. Then, this is um, sesame oil. Um, around te uh, four tablespoons as well. No? Then stir all of them together really well. Next step after you've prepared your chicken, prepare some olive oil in a pan. Let it heat a little bit. Then add the chicken slowly by slowly. Yeah? Do you see the teriyaki sauce is almost done? Actually, it's done. And it's really yummy. Yeah. Turn your chicken slowly, slowly. So the chicken is ready as you can see, it's looking crunchy. Huh? So you put oh the pan is heavy, goodness. Put the chicken in the teriyaki sauce. And then mix all together nicely. Actually. And now you can cover this up. 
So, um, the dough is ready as you can see, but I would advise you if you want to make the teriyaki sandwich, prepare your dough the day before so that you give it enough time. Of course, um, it's okay mine, but I think if I gave it more time, it would even be better, but it's really, it's, it's okay. So what I will do, I'll just divide into small pieces. Mm -hmm. You need three, uh, 200 pound dough if you want to prepare size 300. Just put on it. It's a little bit less. Add more. It's less. High. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. 200. This is how the dough looks like and now I'm going to prepare it to a form but uh, like a sandwich so just just do this here put some egg yolk on the bread like this just so that it get a nice color at the end of the baking yeah? Next step, put a little bit of uh, cheese. This is, um, yeah, it's a special Swiss cheese, but you can take any cheese, grate it, and spice it with some oregano, for example, or you can use timian, you can use whatever you want. And then put it on the bread like this. Don't sprinkle everywhere like I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Sprinkle the cheese on, on top of the bread. You can put the bread in the oven for um, 200 degrees for around 20-25 minutes. Huh? So guys, um, the bread is done and actually now this sandwich is ready to serve. So let, let me cut um, the bread and uh, I will prepare one for you so that you can see how we are doing it. It's too long, eh? If you make <laughs> such a long sandwich, how are you going to eat it? So I divide it by two, like this. Then, as usual, cut it into two. As you can see, the bread is perfect. The same to this one. Then, Oliver, what would you Please. like? Give me tomato. To begin with, which sauce do you want? Ah, sorry. The sauce, uh, this one. This is a um, cocktail sauce. Cocktail sauce, uh, I would like. Ketchup mixed with, um, yeah. with mayonnaise. You Sounds like good. Water? Yes. Yeah. I like that. Yes. And now yes. the teriyaki, right? Yes, teriyaki. prefer the red onions because they are healthy. And I like uh, tomato. Just a moment. And 
uh, Pilipino. No stress, we are not in subway here. Yeah? Then you want tomato? Please. So. Mm. What is? And uh, from the. The Gorka. Yeah. I don't know. It's called in English. I'm sorry. Yes, I think it's Gorka also in English. <laughs> no, it's not Gorka. <laughs> and for the moment, that's all. That's all you want for now. Uh. Any chili? Yeah, chili a little bit. Or you want the hot sauce? I, I want a sambal oleg that is coming from. From uh, my young, also Asia. Asia, directly here to Switzerland. <coughs> How much so, do you want? Oh, that is enough, I think so. Is it too hot? It's very hot and uh, true. It looks harmless, but it will be very spicy. And, uh, so. You don't want salad? <laughs> Okay. Uh, do you want some cheese? Mm hmm yeah. So. Yeah, no sandwich without cheese. Uh-huh, yes, we saw. Good. It's a lot of sort of cheese. Okay. What we normal, what, what mm -hmm. you should do when <laughs> making this meal, please buy some toothpaste or those sticks to hold the sandwich together. Otherwise, you're gonna Get a little bit stressed while you are eating. Okay, so that is the teriyaki chicken sandwich. Thanks so much for watching. And if you like this video and want to see more of my cooking, please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much. Or in case you want me to tell you the details, in, uh, the details, the ingredients in details. Please just um, leave me a comment and I will list everything down. Bye and thank you for watching.